Hello guys, and um, this is day two of my bathroom remodeling project, and I'm gonna be breaking a concrete with a tool that I bought today. It is Bosch Rotary Hammer Drill that I'm gonna be using for this job. So let's open the box and see what we have inside. It comes with plastic case and um, here is the hammer drill. I have instructions here and I also purchased a couple bits. I'm not sure but I think the most job will do a chisel and uh, I'm gonna be using a flat chisel for the most of the job and uh, a second one I purchased just in case if I will have some hard spots that I have to break so I'm not sure if I'm gonna be using this one if you wanna buy the same hammer drill as I have make sure that you're buying SDS plus bits. These bits will fit your hammer drill. SDS plus bits are generally thinner and smaller than SDS max bits. Insert chisel into the chuck through the dust shield while twisting and pushing inward and make sure that the chisel is secured and you're good to go. Now I'm measuring a distance between wall and a drain line. And um, I have to remove all the boards. I don't need them anymore. I'm planning on installing bathtub on concrete. And um, I need to mark where I need to stop breaking concrete and it's 8 inches from the wall. Switching drill to hammer and um, start breaking a concrete. To make your job easier, remove broken concrete once every 10 to 15 minutes. And once you hit the ground, I try to make a hole much bigger so you can uh, remove soil underneath the concrete so it's gonna help you to move and break concrete much faster.
and this is it. In my next video I'm gonna be extending a drain line for a bathtub and if you didn't check my first video on how to remove fiberglass shower please check this out and if you like the video hit the like button and subscribe to my channel thank you for watching and i'll see you in the next video